When you have a tournament that's single elimination with over 60 teams, you're going to have memorable moments. The NCAA tournament produced some of the most memorable NCAA tournament buzzer beaters in the 1990s. 90 Sports Nostalgia presents the top 5 NCAA tournament buzzer beaters in the 90s. And don't forget to subscribe, give us a like and check out more 90 Sports Nostalgia material. In the 1992 second round matchup between the 7th seeded Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets and the 2nd seeded USC Trojans, Yellow Jackets star James Forrest hit a desperation 3 pointer at the buzzer. This shot propelled Georgia Tech into the Sweet 16 who then lost to Memphis State. With only one second remaining and having to go the length of the court, Scott Burrell threw a perfect bomb to Tate George who beat the clock sending the Connecticut Huskies to the regional final and the Clemson Tigers home. Unfortunately for UConn, they lost their next matchup to Duke thanks to Christian Leitner's buzzer beater. It looked as if the 1995 tournament favorites UCLA was about to be upset by the Missouri Tigers but Bruins point guard Tyus Edney went the length of the court to give the Bruins the victory at the buzzer. Furthermore, UCLA did go on to become NCAA champions. Bryce Drew hit this memorable buzzer beater during the 1998 NCAA tournament in which the 13th seeded Valparaiso Crusaders upset the 4th seeded Ole Miss Rebels. Valparaiso did make it to the Sweet 16 before losing to Rhode Island. The top NCAA tournament buzzer beater during the 1990s, Christian Leitner shot against Kentucky. This 1992 regional final has been often called the greatest NCAA basketball game ever. Because of Leitner's heroics, Duke advanced to the Final Four and then later won their second consecutive championship. 